Today, I will be unboxing the first ever Monster Bass Box. Before going any further, it would be greatly appreciated if you would take a moment to subscribe. I spend five to six hours per video making them, editing them, and uploading them to YouTube. So every little bit helps. Thank you. For a bit of backstory, Monster Bass Company was created by Rick Patry. Now, you may recognize him as being the founder and CEO, well, former CEO of Lucky Tackle Box. He had some philosophical differences with how the company was being run and decided to part ways last year. As a result, started Monster Bass. Now these boxes, uh, unlike the company that he was previously with, uh, these are split into various regions of the country. Now this box is for the Midwest and Great Lakes region. Now the reason why Rick decided to split the box up into regions is because of bait preferences. For example, if you're in Michigan in the midwinter, uh, you're not going to, you know, chances are you're not going to be wanting to use something like a hollow body frog. Now, at the same time of the year in Florida, that is perfectly plausible. And people also fish for bass in you know, different ways in different parts of the country. So it really comes down to bait preference. And that is what this box has set out to achieve, is to eliminate the discrepancy. So I just opened the box. Now, the first thing that strikes me is uh, just all these messages that you get as soon as you open up the box. Now, uh, it says show us your bass and uh, allows you to snap a picture of it and then share it on social media with the tag Monster Bass and um, using the tags Monster Bass and the Better Box and you can uh, win prizes every week. So that's kind of a cool feature. And it looks like uh, there's a message on the inside as well, right here, as you can see. Now the message reads, welcome to the better box, hashtag the better box. Everything in this box was hand selected by expert anglers with one goal in mind, helping you hook a monster bass. Whether you're bank fishing in the Northeast or casting from your dock in the Midwest, our regional pros have you covered. Now, get out there and go catch one. And when you do catch one, make sure you show us your monster bass. And then past that we have this letter from Rick. It reads, I want to personally thank you for joining me on this ride as we work together to build the best bass fishing community and subscription box on the planet. Each month we will be curating a box full of baits that are handpicked for the region of the country where you live and fish. So what exactly does that mean? That means that our team of regional experts will evaluate hundreds of baits, analyze industry data, and review tournament results to select the best performing baits for the region of the country where you live and fish. Our promise to you is that your box will always contain regional and seasonal baits that will help you catch more fish. Now, here's where you get to play a role in making the best box. We've included a versatile mix of three hard baits, three soft plastics, and two pieces of terminal tackle that we want you to go out and fish with. In about two weeks, we are going to send you a survey about the box. Now, this is something you'll never see from any other company that makes boxes like this. Not gonna happen. Because they don't care. <laughs> they, it does not concern them if you are satisfied because you purchased a subscription. You're tied in there, all right? <laughs> They've already got your business. This company cares. No other fishing subscription box company does this for their customers. The other guys send you a box of random baits and many times that box is filled with their own brand of baits. Now what does this mean? When you fill a box with your own brand, you save a lot on shipping and a lot on production. You can set the standards where you want to set them and really it's just a tool of reducing costs at the expense of your customers. Now. That's something that this company has promised not to do. In our box, you're always going to find the best brands and the best baits. Combine that with your feedback and we have what is sure to be the best box. A listing of the brands we partner with for this month's box can be found on the other side of this card. 
I thank you and your support and look forward to your feedback. And it's signed, Rick Patrick. Now here are the brands. It looks like it's Booyah, Daiichi, Live Target, Rattle Trap, pardon me, and uh, Smart Bakes, Smart Baits, Strike King, War Eagle, and Z-Man. So that's a very impressive lineup. The first lure that we see here is this. This is a Bait Ball Series Live Target Thread Fin Shad. So this is really cool. And I can imagine this would work excellent in murky water because of this coloration that we see here. It's kind of bright. Um, and I just, I like the design a lot. It looks really good. And uh, yeah, I can imagine fishing with this uh, in really any scenario that I need a crankbait in water that's not crystal clear. Next, we have this spinnerbait by Booyah. This is great. After that, we have these, which are Daiichi wacky rigging hooks. Uh, you get four of them and um, they, I've used these in the past actually, uh, they're very sharp, they work very well, and they're just excellent all-around hooks. After that we have this, these are Z-Man Finesh Room's Ned Rig Jig Heads. Now if you've never used the Ned Rig, you should really give it a try, uh, it is excellent. And furthermore, I just love the names that Z-Man gives a lot of their lures and a lot of their, um, a lot of their equipment that they, they make. The Finesh Rooms. <laughs> That's just a really cool name, and uh, kudos to whoever thought of that. But these are one tenth outs um, Ned Rig uh, hooks right there. To build upon what we just saw, this. We also got this, and this is also by Z Man. And this is, um, these are called TRD Tickler Z's. Now, this is the real difference between Monster Bass and other boxes. Now, if you go with other boxes, the stuff's usually disjointed. You know, they'll have worm hooks and then they'll have something that's, you know, incompatible. Now, look at this. You've got this and you can rig it on this. You can uh, Ned rig these plastics with this. It literally gives you all that you need. And this is, this will be killer. If I were to fish this really on any bed, just, you know, drop that in the middle, I'm sure it would be an absolute magnet for bedding bass. Now here is something that is really cool as well. Now these are Rage Tail. I'm trying to find the actual name of these. Rage Tail Rage Craws. And they are in green pumpkin. This is a seven pack and these are all four inches. There's a variety of ways you could fish this. You could even maybe shave it down a little bit, shave the, the body of it down and, you know, use it as a jig trailer and it would work great. But yeah, that is really cool. And uh, yeah, it's got this coffee scent too. Take a look at that. It's impregnated with the coffee scent. Now, a lot of the rattle traps I use are pretty old. Uh, a lot of them belong to my dad and they last forever. So you can just, you know, keep changing the hooks out of course and essentially use them for, you know, 20, 30 years. Now, this is a newer rattle trap. Well, it's a brand new rattle trap, but it is a half ounce rattle trap. You've got the, um, you know, it's made in the USA. That has not changed, thankfully. Um, and yeah, I mean, this looks like anything that would try to invade a bass bed. Or for a lot of you who aren't, you know, quite into, you know, where the bass are spawning, you know, if you're farther north, this is perfect for fishing those transitioning bass, those are, you know, fish that are starting to enter up into the shallows. This is perfect for, you know, all of your spring and early summer needs. And heck, you could even throw this again in the fall or, you know, in certain situations in the summer. Um, this is really a great lure all year round, but it especially shines right now in the spring. This is a brand I haven't used before, but it looks absolutely amazing. Now, this is called the Doomsday Tackle Company Black Back. Uh, actually, it's called the Sea Shad 3.2. It is three inches long and it's in color Black Back Flash, which is kind of a tongue twister. Uh, six count. There are six of these in the package. Now, these look absolutely amazing. They really do look like shad. <laughs> What's even cooler, I just noticed this 
is that the logo, the company logo, is in the eye. Like, I don't know if I can show you this, but it's in the eye of every single bait in this package. It's got some sort of insert on the belly of these baits where it's like a, like a holographic insert. That is really, really cool. Last, but definitely not least, we have this. This is a Smart Baits. And I'm trying to look for the, the name of the, the, the bait on here. And it's weird because they're not, they, like a lot of companies you'll see they'll have like a sticker here that says what it's called, you know, just so you know what to refer back to. And I'm not seeing that here. And of course you can find them on social media. I'm sure they have a full you know, product line on their website. But here it is. It is, it apparently changes color. It says color changing bait right here. So obviously that's that's what it does. Now from right now I can tell it's kind of like a, like a brown red color, which is perfect for this time of the year where you've got, uh, you know, fish that are bedding. And this is the, uh, <laughs> the best possible bed intruder. Well, obviously. Now, although that may be the last bait in the box, we're not quite done yet as there is this excellent decal you could put on the back of a laptop, you could put it you know, on your car. And if all that wasn't enough, we have a coupon which actually has a promo code so you can receive $10 off any store purchase. Can't beat that. So how do I feel about this box? Well, <laughs> I'm extremely impressed and I think that all of the box's contents have been spot on. The box sets out to provide you with baits that you can use at the correct time of the year in the correct location where you reside and fish. Now, you know, living in Michigan, I can use all of these right now. There's nothing um, that would not be applicable to what I'm currently doing as far as bass fishing. And I really, it just, it's, it's, it, it does what it has set out to achieve. It, 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 100%. I have no qualms with anything in this box. And I cannot say that at all about any of the other boxes on the market because I've received pretty much all of them in the past. I've had, you know, I don't want, without naming names, probably, you know, know what I'm talking about, but I've had them in the past and I can say without a doubt, this box is the only box that acknowledges, you know, bait preference. I can't use a frog in January. It doesn't make sense. All right, this is just, it's spot on. It's, it, it, it really is. Now, if you'd like to go and get one of your own, I have a link down on the bottom. So you can just go click that and it'll take you right there. I mean, I, I can guarantee that you'll be impressed.